Las Cruces Police shining a spotlight on its own history when it comes to officer-involved shootings over the last year. Thanks for joining us. I'm Natasha Paloma. I'm Daniel Muddy, and this is in light of yesterday's deadly shooting of an 81-year-old man. KTSM 9 News reporter Tatiana Favela joins us from Las Cruces to explain. Tatiana. Well, this is the apartment complex where Las Cruces police officers opened fire on an elderly man on Monday. Now, if you take a look behind me, you can actually see where the bullet holes in the apartment unit are, along with some signs, flags, and flowers that people have come by to drop off along the day. Guy. Never, never really bothered anybody that to a point where it's even notable. Tim Boyne says he knew the 81-year-old man who died in Monday's officer-involved shooting. He tells me the elderly man did have moments of frustration, but he believes the man would never mean to hurt anyone. We all knew he was harmless. I mean, we knew that. He, he had some problems, but... uh. He's never violent. The spokesperson with the Las Cruces Police Department, Dan Trujillo, says within the last year, there have been a total of three officer-involved shootings in Las Cruces, including this one. In all three of those incidents, um, the suspect actually fired upon our officers. In one of those instances, the one from June uh, 17th of last year, uh, one of our officers was actually struck. Um, and fortunately, uh, was, his injuries were very minimal. Trujillo adds all Las Cruces police officers are trained to handle these situations, but he points out every situation varies. They're all different. Uh, there's no one way to train and determine exactly how uh, to handle a certain situation. Um, uh, a lot of it uh, uh, requires uh, the career-long uh, training that the officer receives. Despite how the incident unfolded, Boyne believes police were only doing their job and responding as they should. That poor cop. I feel bad for the cop, too, because Mike wasn't the kind of guy who was going to come out there and try to shoot down a cop. He just wasn't that kind of guy. Not to take away from your right and your responsibility. They had a responsibility out here yesterday, and they they took care of business. People should not be shooting at other people. They should not be pointing guns at other people. And, um, you know, people, cops are people. You know, police are people. Investigators say no officers were injured during the shooting, and the three officers who fired at the man have been placed on standard administration leave. Live in Las Cruces, Tatiana Favela, KTSM 9 News. All right, Tatiana, thank you. The attorney